Hi, this is Richard Byrne. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can use Flippity.net and Flickr to create a random story prompt generator. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the Flippity flashcard template. You just click on the template here and you'll make a copy into your Google Drive. And so you can see here there's some sample content already pulled in here. Now this is set up as flashcards for kids to review and quiz themselves. But right now I have audio turned on. You can see I have audio English. I'm going to go ahead and turn that off and say none. Likewise over here on this side I'm going to say none as well. Now you can also customize your card background color if you want to and your card text color if you want to. But in our case we're not going to do that because we're going to replace the text with image links from Flickr. So let's go over to Flickr and you can see I've already done a search for the word rain and images related to rain and I did a search for images that have no known copyright restrictions. You can do that right here by selecting the type of licensing that you want and you can see I also have a safe search turned on. Now let's say I want to use this picture over here. So I have this picture here and I'm going to go and look at the sharing options. By the way, you can notice that this image says it's in the public domain right there. So let's go into the sharing options and I'm going to select the embed option and I'm going to turn off the footer for now. If you were to truly embed this into a web page, you might want to display the footer with the image information, but I'm going to turn that off. And now I'm going to grab that code. I'm going to place it right here in my first line. Now, there's a ton of extra information in there that I don't need for this. All I really need is the image source information. So let's go ahead and grab just that part. And the part that we need is just this section right here. So that's all I need is that little bit of information. So now I'm just going to highlight that all again and paste in just that link that ends in JPG. Now, I'll repeat that process for every image that I want to put in here. Now on the back side, if I wanted to write in uh, a little prompt for my students, I might say something like, talk about a fun rainy day. Now let's go ahead and take a look at how we publish this. So we're going to go to publish to the web and say yes we want to publish it. Now let's grab that link and we'll go down to the flippity template where it says get the link here and in this space we'll copy in that link from the previous screen when we published the spreadsheet hit your enter or return key and now you see click here to get linked to your Flippity flashcards and we'll see now the image appears in our flashcard and on the back side I can say talk about a fun rainy day so that's how you can use Flippity and Flickr together to create, create a series of writing prompts for your students for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com.